Greetings and welcome to today's lesson. In today's lesson, we're going to go over our spelling words for the day. As we do so, make sure you're participating well using your hands and fingers, break words into syllables and sounds, and make sure that when we write it, you are writing it as best you can with all the appropriate spaces, rules, and markings. Now, again, as we go through the words, make sure you're following along and trying to do all the things with me that I do. The first word is endure. So endure means when something is hard, when you're going through something, you have to endure it. Endure. Base word, endure. Endure. E-N-D-U-R-E. Endure. All right, let's write endure. Endure. N D U once or once E once endure. Now the next word is during. So when you're do in the midst of something, you're doing it during it. Like I'm watching a show during my free time. During base word during. Dur ing d u r i ung during. During. Do. Doer, ing, da you, to, r, i, ung, once, during. So here, uh, the, it's not that endure is the base word, but here we have a u. So just remember that here, during, it's going to have a u as well. Right? And we'll brace these two. The next word is until. So how long until dinner? Until. Base word until, un till, a n t i o until, un till, a n t i o until. Next word is true, like be true, true. Base word true, t r u e, true, right? True. T r u e true markings t r u once e twice job two All right but here uh, we have the next word is truly right so i write true and normally i would just add l y but in this case, I don't need this E anymore because if I add L-Y, U is not going to be at the end of the word. So I'm going to do it without the E and add L-Y to make the word truly. True, le, t, r, u, o, i, truly. True, le, t, r, u, once, rule, four, o, i, rule, six. So here, you may say you at the end of a syllable, and English words can't end I, so use a Y. All right, the next word is hole, like I dug a hole in the ground. Hole, hole, O O E, hole. O O E, O once, O once, E once, hole. Now the next word is hole, like I ate a whole pizza. But this time, I'm going to use a sound it's not supposed to say, like in the word who, right? We use the WH there. We're going to use a WH here. Whole. O O E. Using a WH. Okay, write the word whole. O O E. Markings. Twice. O O O once. O once. E once. Whole. So, one way you can remember this that might be helpful is when you're talking about the whole something, it's such, it's all of it so much, we just add an extra letter because it's so big, right? The next word is address. So here, this could be like your address, like where you live, the, the, the name of your street with the number, that's your address. Or you can use it to address someone when you're speaking to someone or speaking to a crowd. Address, base word, address. Add, dress. Add, da, da, r, a, s. Address. Add. Dress. At the rule twenty-nine. The rule seventeen. 
Okay, roll 29. I need this D right here, otherwise the A would be the syllable and it would look like A dress. And English words often double, uh, and an S often double. The S doubles here, rule 17. The next word is request, right? So here you have the base word quest when you're going out to look for something, uh, right? So if you're on a quest, you're seeking after something. But if you make a request, you're asking someone to give you something. So you're not going out and searching on your own, but you're asking someone else to do it for you. Request, base word, request, or, uh, sorry, prefix re, base word, quest. I write we, re, add quest to make the word request. Request, re, quest, request. Re, quest. Re once, rule four. Qua once, rule two. Est, request. E may say E at the end of a syllable, rule four. English words that have a Q have to be followed by a U, rule one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And the last word is raise, like raise your hand. Raise, base word raise. R A Z E. A not used in an S. Raise. R A Z E. R A once. Z E twice job five. Here, the E is not technically doing anything. It's probably there so that the S is not the end, so it doesn't look plural, but that's not technically a job, so it's not doing anything. All right, well, that's the end of our lesson for today. I hope you have a terrific day, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye.